I guess y'all wonder where I've been. Well, I got off the road for a couple of weeks, came back home from base camp, Virginia. I got to get all my doctor stuff taken care of, my medical checkups, and make sure my prescriptions are right and everything. And um, I figured while I was home, I'd go ahead and upgrade on my refrigerator and also on my portable power station. So what I did, I went to a 45 quart set power refrigerator freezer got a beautiful pop-up top it's got a divider right here you can pull it out you can either use it as a refrigerator freezer or you can use it as a refrigerator or you can just pull this out and use it as a freezer so in other words it's you know you got three different ways you can use it it's got dual controls over here for each side one there and one there pretty simple to figure out you, it's got real nice handles I mean they're strong handles they really are but also the top pops on and off if you want it to pop up this way if you want it to pop up that way you just pull it out and reset it in there but overall it's you know it feels like it's a real good unit I'm going to set it up and show it to y'all in a second but I first I just wanted to in, introduce you to it but anyway it's made by set power it seems like a really good refrigerator freezer it's a lot bigger than what I used I used to have a, a 30 quart so I have an extra 15 quarts now and I really needed it and I really wanted the freezer because I want to start eating better and I figure out I can freeze a lot of meats and then you use a slow cooker during the day to cook the stuff and uh, yeah okay let's move over here to the portable power station okay the portable power station this unit is a 1200 it's made by the company light power it's got all the accessories you need it's got three receptacle plug-ins it's got your cords for your like your gopro your camera or your laptop charge at it's got the dc plug-in right there to charge anything dc you can also charge it with 110 shore power or you can charge it with 12 volt or you can charge it with solar panels it's really a nice setup i mean it feels like it's built real good. It's got real nice readouts up here. It's got your input, it's got your output. It shows you what percentage you got power is left in the power pack on. Okay, anyway, it has your input, your output, and shows you how much power is in. So let's go to step two and get this stuff hooked up. Okay, let's jump back over here to the refrigerator freezer. It comes with a manual, it explains to you everything usually you know they're pretty simple but it has directions in case you're like me you need to be able to read everything but anyway I'll put a lot of this information I'll detail it on the video it also comes with a pretty decals if you like little sticky decals it comes with a three-year compressor warranty and a one year on all other parts of warranty okay you can use this refrigerator three different ways you can use it DC you can use it off your cigarette lighter and you can run it off the shore power. I'm gonna use it on the power packs, but you can also run it off of a power pack hook to solar panels if you want, but it's pretty simple. It's got a little cord right here. You take this cord, plug it into this box right here, just like that. Now I got it running off of the 12 volt DC side of the power pack. It's got a little on and off button right here. You push the button right there and it says, both sides are running at 73 and 75. It takes roughly about 15 minutes for this thing to cool down to almost freezing. Uh, it's pretty easy. You just set what you want it at, and it's good to go. Now I got it set. It's running. Uh, it seems to be real quiet. I won't give it that much, but okay as y'all can see these are the controls right here i'm gonna go ahead and plug it okay she's plugged in now all you do is cut her on okay she's on you got 71 on the left side and you got 75 on the right side right here you got max or kind of kind of load you can do it either way that's if you want to conserve your energy that's if you want to go as fast as you can these this button here takes your temperature up and this one here takes it back down this side is set on zero this side here is set on 43 I can take it down a little bit more so I'm gonna take it down to 40 so now it's on 40 
okay the refrigerator it runs real smooth real nice handles right here I mean they got a whack to them I mean as you can see they're really nice but anyway I'm gonna see how long it takes they say it can go down to zero like in 15 minutes so have to wait and see but there you go this is a pretty simple control just on and off this is just send you in your setting to use max or kano and then these your temperature gauge right now the left side this is for your left side this is for your right side when the cooler is trying to face me so yeah real nice setup i really like that it plugs in real easy and like i stated before you can run it off a 12 volt or you can run it off a shore power either way you know really nice system i really like this it also came with a cover i'm going to show you the cover of it too okay this is the cover it came with which is real nice when you have insulation cover like this it really it, it your refrigerator doesn't have to work that so hard because it's got this cover in it and it makes it run a lot easier and it doesn't suck your power dry as you know it's got a little pouch right there got another little pouch right there it's very nicely made i mean as you can see that's good quality you just put the refrigerator in there and snap it shut and there you go i'll show y'all what it looks like in just a second okay as you can see it fits very nicely you can still read your dials right here because it's got clear plastic covered it you still got it plugged in um yeah, as you can see it unzips really super easy and it unzips and boop there you go i mean it's really nice it's a very nice setup and then you just close the top and zip it back up but that there adds a lot of insulation to your cooler and that way you won't be burning so much power with this insulated cover on it which is really a good idea but i'll show you settings real quick that you know how quick it's going down okay as you can see the settings it's really going down i mean it's still plugged in got a little cover right there it plugs in you can still get to the handles real easy but overall that is a super nice cover super nice refrigerator too i'll give you all pink on the inside of the refrigerator also okay there's the inside of the refrigerator and as i was saying this piece right here comes out just like that the basket also comes out uh, this side right now is a freezer and this right this side over here is just a regular fridge but it's got a real nice top it's got a good seal all the way around it it closes really tight i mean you can hear it tight it's also a reversible door when you have a door this way or you can open up the door that way whichever you decide to do but overall this is a really good unit i mean and it's so easy to run and i mean they've come a long ways with this control board right here but see it's not taking long for it to come on down in temperature but overall this is a really nice unit it really is i mean this is a keeper for me right here really nice unit anyway i hope you all enjoyed the review of this product uh this is a go good for me and another thing going by the gauge on the um net power power pack it's only using 45 watts which is really super good i mean i think all i'm used to use about 45 watts but yeah overall this is a real good product i mean once again it's made by the company called set power if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up and hopefully within the next week or two i'll get back out on the road and start making videos again i believe what i'm gonna do this year i'm gonna go south because i want to spend some time down in georgia and then work my way over to arkansas and oklahoma and maybe texas and then i'm probably gonna go to arizona this year and you know spend a little bit of time in new mexico but overall i'm gonna go to arizona for the winter probably but uh yeah if y'all enjoyed this product check it out i put links below in the description and uh yeah i'm sure they got a discount code for me i put that in the description of the video but check them out a well-built company a well-built refrigerator you'll enjoy it plus it's a good side one but anyway there you go set power